Hey you guys, I am standing outside of Costco with the sales paper in my hand and it is back to school time. So we're gonna go in and find some of the healthiest things that you can put in your kids' lunch boxes this year. A crunchy snack is always something that kids tend to like in their lunch box. I'm gonna show you some of my favorite chips or just kind of crunchy snacks in general. We've got these plantain chips. They are made with Himalayan sea salt is the salt that they use and the oil is the coconut oil, which is one of the best oils that they could have fried this in. Um, and then for chips, I really like these grain-free tortilla chips. They use avocado oil, which is another really great oil, um, as well as sea salt. And then if you wanna be a little adventurous, they have these crunchy dried beets. They're unsweetened, they're unsulfured. The only ingredient is beetroot. So I would be interested to try this maybe with some hummus or even guacamole and just see what it tastes like. And they're getting some extra veggies in their lunchbox. So speaking of hummus, I do want you to watch out and be aware because most hummus, uh, even though we think it's super healthy, uh, at the store has soybean oil. This one also has some potassium sorbate. Right next to it, we have the organic, um, but even with the organic, they still use sunflower oil, which I feel like is a bit better. Um, I would still probably get this one, but there's none here right now, but sometimes you can find some brands without that, that actually use olive oil, but this does not have any natural flavors. So right now, this is the best one. It is on sale here at Costco. They also have the individually packaged hummuses, um, still with some sunflower oil. And then I absolutely love these little individually packed guacamole pouches. These are excellent and have really clean ingredients. A lot of times what I like to do is kind of look at what, what are like the pre-made meals looking like and I'll kind of do that myself at home. So one of the things is like cheese and crackers and I absolutely love these Simple Meals almond flour crackers. They're absolutely delicious and look at these ingredients here. We just got the nut and seed flour blend which is really great because that gives it some protein. Um, and then we've got organic ingredients, sea salt, um, no extra preservatives, nothing crazy. So these are some absolutely wonderful crackers. If you can find this bread at your Costco, snag it. Oh my goodness, I just still can't believe the price. $5.99 for two loaves of this organic sprouted bread. I feel like my Costco always has this bread in short supply, so you can definitely buy it and freeze it. It freezes very well. But sandwiches are a really great way to just make a really fast lunch. You can do turkey sandwiches. You could do egg salad sandwiches. You can do regular peanut butter jelly sandwiches. You can like have so many options when it comes to sandwiches for that lunchbox. And this bread is a great place to start. A really high protein meal that you can throw in a lunchbox is actually some form of tuna salad. And this one is really great. It is wild tuna and it they actually test it for mercury which is excellent and the ingredients is just the tuna and the sea salt this would actually pair really well with those almond flour crackers we were looking at earlier or you could put it on some of that bread and make a delicious sandwich definitely scoop up some of this nutso to put on your kids sandwich i know some schools don't allow peanut butter because of allergies but it gives a punch of goodness it is packed full of all of these amazing nuts and seeds these organic string cheeses are um, a great thing to throw in a lunchbox as well as these tillamook. If they want to switch it up from the mozzarella cheese, you can always do this medium cheddar. These are 52 individual cheeses. If your kids like mozzarella, this is also a cool option. They have this fresh, fresh mozzarella snacking cheese. They're in three little mozzarellas per little package and we've got some pretty clean ingredients there. Costco definitely has some great deals um, on some shred, uh, some sliced cheese as well as it's all gone, but this is my favorite turkey here. Um, look for this brand, but my box is empty. I am so excited about these. I have never seen these almond flour tortillas before. These are grain free tortillas. These would be so great to make like a turkey wrap or even a hummus wrap to throw in a lunch box. Absolutely great ingredients I'm seeing here. I absolutely love this organic sausage. Um, and what I like to do with it is you can cut it in cubes and like use toothpicks. You can make some little tiny um, shish kebabs with this and maybe a tomato and maybe a chunk of cheese. Um, that is a really fun lunchbox meal. Some dried fruit would be a really good option to throw in a lunchbox because um, it stays good and fresh even if it's not refrigerated all day. When buying dried fruit, you do want to make sure you're getting the unsulfured 
right? So just make sure on the ingredients that it's truly just the dried fruit. Uh, opposed to something like these nectarines here, when you flip them over, you can see the sulfur dioxide is one of the preservatives and that is just something that I really like to avoid. Also know with some things like cherries and blueberries uh, as well as cranberries, because they're not as sweet as some other fruit, they do typically have some form of sugar as well as some oil so they don't stick together. So just know that going into it, this actually has 13 grams of added sugar, which I feel is like quite excessive. These little applesauce pouches are always a, a good buy. And I like these because it's just apples and the ascorbic acid. They don't have any form of added sugar, which is great. And these come up to 35 cents a pouch. Something fun I like to do for our lunch boxes sometimes is do kind of like a breakfast for lunch thing. So I like to get some of this granola. You could throw in some yogurt. If you don't have little containers you can send it in, you can always buy the individualized cups and maybe we'll find some of those here in a bit. Um, but I love, again, the same Autumn's Gold brand has some great granola as well as those granola bars. This is the toasted coconut almond flavor, and we can see here the ingredients are super clean. They use the coconut oil, they use real vanilla and no natural flavors. This is some great granola right here. So these Gogurt simple squeezy tubes are gonna be tempting, but here is why um, I would take a pass. Um, it has modified cornstarch. Nowhere on here is it organic. Nowhere on here is it non-GMO verified, which number one means we've got some GMOs. We also have a natural flavor. Um, and then when we go into the um, the, the actual flavoring here, it, there's no form of fruit or anything. Like the natural flavor is the only thing that, that flavors it. And we have 12 grams of added sugar. So unfortunately, I just don't really think these are the absolute best that we can find. They also have this trail mix snack pack on sale right now. Um, the only thing that I'm seeing with this one is in the cranberries, there is some sunflower oil. But other than that, these are really great ingredients. Um, they're 24 uh, individual servings, so it's only 39 cents per pack. And of course, every lunchbox has to have some kind of treat, you know. So I am gonna show you some kind of sweet options that you can add in that lunchbox to just give them a nice little dessert there too. For $9.89, I really love these Unreal. Uh, Unreal is a brand. These are dark chocolate coconut minis. They also still have these real fruit yo-yo bear fruit roll-up, basically. They've got strawberry, raspberry, and mango. And what I love about them is that is literally just the ingredients. That's all there is to it. These are so wonderful right now. $9.99 for 48 rolls. That is like a killer deal. They do also have these That's It mini fruit bars. These are also really great clean ingredients, just apples, strawberry, apples, mangoes, apples, blueberries. These are a little bit more pricey um, and you get less of them, but if your Costco only has these, these are a great option as well. My absolute favorite, favorite granola bar here at Costco are these Autumn's Gold grain-free granola bars. And what you see here on the front, as, the, as far as the ingredients go, is the same thing here on the side. So these have five grams of added sugar. They're very fulfilling, very delicious, absolutely kid approved, lunchbox approved. Another fun lunchbox dessert my kids really like are these organic puffed brown rice crunchy rollers. Um, the ingredients here are pretty minimal. It has four grams of added sugar, um, but this is just a really fun treat for any lunchbox. Well, thanks for going through the store with me. Hopefully you found some great ideas for not just your kids' school lunches, but even maybe you as you're going to work, as you're packing lunches that need to stay cold or that can even be reheated. But hopefully this was helpful. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, share it with a friend, and until next time, you guys have a very blessed, blessed day.